That was seriously fucked yes, up. Always. Listen, I'm gonna need you not to have balls on this one. They're trying to like put everybody that went to the riot in prison. I'm sitting there like, good luck with that. How are you gonna arrest like a thousand people? I don't know if everybody needs to go. I don't. Everyone that broke into the Capitol, sure, but I don't. I don't know. I don't know how they're gonna handle that. I think it's mostly the people who like actually broke in. Yeah, because that's like trespassing. I'm sure there's all sorts of fucking laws about them. I can't find this video. And it's construct claimed election fraud when there's no evidence anywhere. Such a fucking idiot. Trump is 200 IP. Every court throughout his case. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Even if it's the truth, just, just accept it, man. I'm sure there's, there's like, discrepancies in the election, but it's not as bad as what he's putting it out to be. It's stuff like voter, like, voter suppression and the shit that was going on with USPS. Like, I can understand why he's upset, but... The pandemic, dude, hey! We're enough to turn the election over. The pandemic. I don't think Pandemic? Do you really think that's planned? The whole Senate almost got fucking shot up. I know. If they went the wrong direction, they would have. Well, shot up. There was actually pipe bombs there too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They were going to assassinate Congress. Oh yeah. They were gonna kill Nancy Pelosi. That shows who really takes action, who doesn't. The right side is more radicalized than the left. I don't know about that. The left is Have you seen the radical left? The radical left is just as fucking crazy. Yeah, they're pretty equal, I feel like that kind of... Like, even the radical left shoot people. Stop. <laughs> I just want to bust a nut in this bitch's ear. In her ear? Yeah, that's how you show dominance, you know, you just drop a load in her ear. What the fuck? Dude fires a RPG and uh... Uh, gun range? That's fake as hell. Our pilot is still drunk and was supposed to be in the air by Sorry. now. Sorry. Can he fly in this condition? Well, he sure can't fucking fly with one arm. Uh, okay, Horton, Anya, get him some coffee or something to sober him up. Uh, and Blaskowitz, fly I cannot find that video. Dude, the fucking media is showing the Capitol riots like it's the Discovery Channel. I swear. <laughs> I believe you. I can't even find it. I believe you. If I it's believe a guy. Regardless, whoever got, whoever got shot, got. I think he got shot in the chest. <laughs> God damn. It was. You got shot and he flew back. <laughs> yeah, he did. That was fucking crazy. <laughs> Why? Why you always gotta be losing your arm? That video was fucking crazy. Yeah. There's lit, 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 lit. Pack for quality content. Fergus on? I've seen a bro. That's all I I think they took them all down. Took them down. I would. That would have died if Antifa showed up to the riots and just had a fucking fight with the. Trump supporters. Any luck finding Fergus's arm? Do not think I've been there too. I 
Okay, here okay. we go. I literally think these are people who have like no life and just sit there and brew in their ideology. Pretty much. That sounds about right. I can't tell if that's a guy or a girl. <laughs> it looks like a girl. <laughs> I can't tell. Holy shit, this is a graphic video. Good. That was crazy. Good graphics, forehead. Hey, Bear Shack. So, for Ferguson's arm. And these radicals are something else, man. <laughs> you know, I did see Fergus late last night. They're wilding. We want to fuck Donald Trump in the ass. Donald Trump's cum tastes like peanut butter. Damn, they're losing their fucking minds. It's gonna be planted up the apes soon, dude. Yo, wait till one senator gets shot, dude. All the ooh, ooh, ooh. come out of the jungle, dude. If it's honest, full blown civil war about a second, dude. Dude, if a senator dies, civil war will spark up. That's not if one dies, probably. Yeah. If all of Congress got fucking killed that day, that would have been crazy. I don't know what would have happened. It probably didn't happen for a reason. Well, one reason why everything is so tense is because of COVID. Oh, yeah. Like, people are going fucking mental, man. They're getting laid off from their trash jobs. And they're like, I'm fucking crazy! I'm gonna go to the Capitol riots. Boom, 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 boom. So you saw him storm off toward the hangar. Mm hmm. I don't think I've ever seen a man that angry. Thanks. My friend said that Republican Congress people were trying to show them where Democrats were. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Yeah. To the crowd so they could go kill him. Outplayed. That's fucking savage. Alright. Fergus was last seen heading for the hangar fuel depot. And he left his arm there. This video was violent and graphic. If Trump doesn't get convicted of something, then he truly is above the law. He 
kind of is in his own way. He is because he's the president and he's rich. But the fact of the matter is, no matter how much money you have, it shouldn't put you above the law. Right. I agree. I should show up there and just throw a grenade in the crowd. No, 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 no. Kappa. I can't tell in that video, but I didn't realize it was a fucking shot in the mouth. Haha, <laughs> god damn. Is that where got a shot? Yeah, we're t the, video, the video we talked about. You got shot in the mouth? Yeah. Holy fuck, this job must have been hanging off, dude. I couldn't find the video I was talking about, but... It's the same video at a different angle from a different protest. Or gang, something. gang, baby. Hey. It's terrible. So, you were a the old guys. You found it. I feel like everything's... Anyway... It's his life. Yeah, I'm a Some bad shit happens. That's what happens. I think Trump needs to, to go to fucking jail. Trump? Yeah. Uh, what, you think he's gonna go to jail? He literally, co he literally caused like four people will. to die. I don't know if he will, Shane, but uh, he deserves to go to jail. Yeah. He's the commander. Honestly, and he denies everything, which is even fucking worse, honestly. <laughs> He's banned off of every social media platform for it. He caused multiple people to die and several people get injured. Yeah. Which is the... the way to vote. Which I've never seen any fucking president ever do in my life. Well, if you count war, but I don't know. I mean, this is completely different. This is a I can't even blame, I can't really blame the Middle East thing on Bush because we got attacks. They should have wiped the sandwich out, dude. I want to see some action, dude. What the fuck, dude? For real though, that would have been crazy if they started killing senators. Dude, that, that would throw a civil war down, dude. We would win the civil war, the left or the right? The government would win. It doesn't matter who wins. Or, they used to it wouldn't be the left or the right, it would be the government, because they got fucking military and we don't. Yeah, yeah but American people have beat the military before. Well, if we, if every single person grabbed a gun, we would win, yeah. The odds are most people wouldn't fight. Fucking go full bag with these. Next thing you know, you're... What? <laughs> 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 Civil 
I need to put ice in this fucking thing. Okay, I get it. You're not a Nazi. <laughs> it's you. I'm in love with you. Don't you understand that you're dumb? Yeah, supposedly there were officers letting people in. Yeah, uh, officer. I heard about that. Don't shoot, uh, uh, officer. Boom. <sighs> But I wonder, like, legally, if they're supposed to do that because it's public. The Capitol's a public building. Well, I don't know. A lot of what? Shoot? No, just let them in the building. Ah. It's public. The Capitol's public property. It's not private. Right. Which means you have a right to be there. You got a right to pay. I don't know. I, th I think they, they said it's like, it's technically trespassed, man. Is it? I don't know the laws. Well, they knew their intentions. That didn't help either. All right, Sig. You're the expert here. Lay it out for us. I guess it's against the law because, uh, they told them to stay out and they, you know. Well, I don't, I don't know. This will give us the greatest chance of surviving Odin's opening salvo. I know it's fucked up. If we're lucky, we make it back out before Odin has a missile lock on us. I mean, it could have been a lot worse, but four people yeah. did die. Yeah, our big Gotham, like we said. The whole country. That could have been a lot of fucking work. Damn, dude. I got blacked. I'm supposed to start running right away? God damn, dude. Run! Holy shit. What the fuck do you mean, run, dude? Run. Tell me to run. I mean, shit, you got my nigger mouth. Oh, I ran backwards. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on, William. What the fuck are you guys doing, dude? Popping nuts. Mm. I'm gonna kill him in Auschwitz. Auschwitz. Oh, shit. Welcome to Auschwitz. We're in Nazi Central, dude. Fuck. Hey! They found me, dude. The alarm's blaring. Body's dropping, guns clapping. Hey. See Nancy Pelosi coming out crying about some guy wearing a. Uh, Man, a Nazi shirt? Or an Oswald shirt? Out of everything that went down, she's, Two of them she's crying about the automated defense system. Who's on that? Nancy Pelosi, talking about a guy wearing an Oswald shirt. The starboard defenses. Finally, says the <laughs> oh, no. I mean, I get it. That's funny. You want me to tell you? No, I think I've seen it. In the center of the room, which will open the door leading she to went the on like a talk show. Found it. I don't understand. William, find a Hogan control center and shut down the port defense system. I'll stay here and try to figure out a way around I need to find a weapon attachment. Me boy attachment shit. These are pretty cool. What? On a post. Oh, I'll see you in a second. I think 
pretty sure Brett's the only one that's gonna like it. Putting holes well, in you, your body. You might like it, but oh, I don't care. Fuck that, dude. Two fucking giant robots. Yeah, Rudy Giuliani said, let's have trial by combat. Yeah. That's so fucked. Trial by combat, dude. Biden versus Trump in combat. Yo, who do you think would win the fight? Trump would fight. I think Trump would beat Biden's ass. Yeah, cause he's fist fight? Biden versus Trump in a fist fight. Actually, Trump might have a heart attack. <laughs> like, Try to catch him. <laughs> I don't know if Biden can dodge his punches. It'd be the only way. <laughs> Trump is better. This is a dementia episode. Turns to a fucking werewolf. Destroys him, dude. <laughs> <laughs> he has dementia and thinks he's in a... I don't know. And Trump, Trump would fall on his butt and start crying like a baby. <laughs> while Biden's trying to figure out where he is. Exactly. Damn, dude. Trump's a man child. He is. He likes to pretend that he's being the man, though. That's the funny part. It reminds me of someone called Josh. You ever heard of him? Dude? Yeah. I bet Maggie feels bad because she had sex with him. Haha. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Nah. I mean, I'm. You don't think so? It is. I mean, I can't speak yeah. for someone. But yeah. I mean, I'm sure, like. Much talk and shit, but. No one likes to mess up like that. Messing up a relationship's not fun. Especially when you put three years into it. And that person just spits in your face, like... That's pretty crazy to me. I, I don't get it, personally. Bruh. Shoot. What? Check out that, that photo. Oh, hell yeah, dude. What the fuck am I doing? Dude? Oh, those are the pose. Those are cool. It's from the forest temple, yeah. It's yeah, pretty dope. Dude. Yeah, the po bosses, I remember. I remember one where you have to do a puzzle to summon the po. And one of them you have to light- the first one you have to light torches, and one you have to solve a puzzle. What in the actual fuck? Uh... So let, let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. The first time you fought Phantom Ganon, was it? Did you fuck up? A lot. Yeah. I, I didn't understand. I remember because I played it when I was like six years old, and I did. I didn't know how to predict how Phantom Ganon was, which one was the real one, and it has to do with his glowing eyes. I'm pretty sure. Cause you remember you had to rotate the pictures with the bow. Yeah. And the one that has glowing eyes is the real Ganon. Yeah, it's oh, a pain in the ass. Maybe a fake he'll, like, of himself. he'll like hop in and out of paintings. It's a fucking. It's annoying. Yeah. Hey. And then, That's like, one of my favorite uh, fights, though. I love fighting Phantom Ganon. It's definitely really cool. I like yeah. the. Because you get like trapped in a room with a bunch of paintings and he just like hops in and out. It's awesome. What? That's crazy. The last fight, though, that shit's annoying. Like, uh... This is before he turns into, like, Ganon. Yeah. You know, the beast. Yeah, the, the pig thing. Yeah, before that, uh... You're up in the tower and you're fighting him. You have to use the light arrows to knock him out. Yeah. That shit's... That shit was annoying when I was a kid. <laughs> oh, you're talking about when you fight Ganondorf. Yeah. That shit was like annoying. actual Ganondorf. You have to have like the hover boots on because you like when he hits you. Yeah. Like, <laughs> shit's so annoying. You have to knock back his uh, blast and then you run up. You have to like hover over to the platform and then hit him with the sword. That's right. You don't even use a light arrow. I forgot about that. 
No, I think you can in that fight, actually. I know, you have to hit the ball as well. You have to hit the, the blast with your sword and it goes back and hits him, and after like three strikes, he goes down on the ground. Yeah, and then uh, the closer to you, the closer you are to killing him, it gets more intense. It's like an intense version of ping pong. Ping pong. That was actually, that was a harder fight than the actual Ganon fight. It is. I beat Ganon my first try with these. He's... Yeah. Yeah, Ganon's not that bad. Nah, there's harder bosses than Ganon. Yeah, like... Yeah. Twin Road is a fun Link. fight. Here's Shadow Link. Dark Link might be actually the hardest fight in the game. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it has to be. Especially if you don't know how to fight him. Yeah, you have to bait him. I don't know if it's the hardest, it. but it's the most it's the most frustrating. It's either that or the the painting Ganon, yeah, the Shadow Ganon, because that can be tough as well. Is it Majora's Mask? Ocarina. Oh, okay. But Majora's Mask. Oh, no. I can't play that game. I love that game. I can't play it though. Majora's my favorite Zelda. Uh, I don't know. I love everything about Majora's, but but the time mechanic. I love the time mechanic and I hate the time mechanic. Well, it's like you have to manage it all throughout the game, which kind of increase. It makes the difficulty a little bit higher, but it's more of an annoyance than difficult. I see where you're going. Let me just put it this way. When I play a game like Ocarina of Time or any Zelda game, I don't want to be stressed the fuck out. When I play Majora's Mask, I literally have to manage time. <laughs> it's micromanaging and it, it pisses me off. Microtransactions. It's like, alright, you are you have to be on the first day to go fight a boss, right? I hate that shit. Like, time doesn't... Time doesn't stop when you're in a fucking a temple. Time doesn't even exist. Oh, joking. <laughs> oh my god, remember that <laughs> conversation? <laughs> this fucking joke. Yeah, you were like high as shit that day. Yeah, I was. Time doesn't even exist. <laughs> That's what happens. Oh man, Majora's Mask. Good game though. Really, none of the boss fights in Majora's Mask are that hard. It has to be the most complicated game. The most complicated It's the most Zelda complicated game. Zelda, yeah, by far. You have to manage time with everything. Like, you, you remember the cafe quest? Like, if you... Yes. The cafe quest starts on the first day, on the first morning, and it ends at the final day at night. Wow. Like you, well, that's that like one of the last so things long. you have to do. Yeah. You don't, I don't, I don't think you can do that mission unless you have a majority of the masks. I'm pretty sure you have to have a good portion of them. You have to have the stone mask and know that, because you have to get in that dungeon. The rush check here. Yeah. And you have to be that far in the game too. I think you have to have Epona by then. I think there's like yeah, a... Yeah, you have to have Epona. I think there's like a fence you have to jump. Uh... That, I love that game, but it's so frustrating. <laughs> I can't. I want to play it monitor. again. It, that's that's one of those <laughs> games you literally need a strategy guide right next to you. I've only that's, beaten it from beginning to end twice, and it takes me. It always takes me like two or three weeks to beat it. It feels like a job. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Yeah. But that's like the price you pay for the one of the coolest Zelda games. It's the yeah, most it was a game. game was Oracle Seasons, but it was on Game Boy. Yeah, yeah, I remember. I that. wish they remake that. Ages and shit. If if they made that in a modern engine, like on Switch or something, that'd be cool. I mean, I don't know if, how you feel about the Link to the Past, or I mean the Link, Link's Awakening. 
The remake of uh, the Game Boy Color game, or the Game yeah. Boy slash Game Boy Color. Uh, I don't. I like the art style, but uh, that game was fucking hard. Actually, I I played it all the way through. I rented it, and uh, man, that's that's a tough game. They want like fifty dollars for that game. I'm like, fuck that. No, I no, I rented it. Yeah, I beat it in five days. It's a good game though. It's fun. It's it's definitely tough. You need uh like there's a whole uh a whole trade a whole trade sequence you have to do to get farther in the game and there's no way you get to a certain point where you're like how the fuck am i supposed to get over to this place that's what i'm saying right now dude and there's literally a spot in the grass where you have to cut and then there's like a stair a staircase that goes down and underground and that's how you get over there there's no other way you would know that. That's that's the shit that pisses me off. Just like in the first Zelda game where they're like, uh, just figure it out. Just figure it out, dude. Just burn, just the burn game trees. Color games might be... were so hard for that. I don't think they did that in seasons. Like seasons ages was cool, fucking bro. hard. Dude. Seasons, you actually had to use the. The rod of seasons or whatever, and you had to change yeah. the weather to get yeah, past certain was, shit. That was Same so thing fun. with the time, you had to change the path of these here. You know what they should remake? Is uh, the Minish Cap. The Minish Cap was so fucking good too. That was one of those games that looked Take really good. Really cock really cock hard. Gets my dick hard. They make that cock fucking hard as a rock. Blow loads left and right. Beat your meat like it's acting out. You're like, boom! <laughs> Damn, dude. If I had, if I had to ask for one remake, it'd probably be. Ugh. I don't know. Better girl salary cap. I don't like <laughs> that game. I know, it's fine to show up with that. I play the third one. Uh, I play the third one and the second one. Come. How are they? Wait, what kind of game is it? There's, there's stealth games. Okay, yeah. Uh, the third one's really good. Kinda. Well done, William. The poor defense system. They're kind of more goofy Splinter Cells. Splinter Cells is a challenging game. Yeah, it is. I remember the first Splinter Cell came out on GameCube. Yeah, I was watching my dad play it on Xbox, it and I could, that shit was above me. I was like, you you mean you have to hide bodies and break into the doors? You have to shoot out cameras, you have to use like your night vision, and you, you, you begin with a USPS. It's really like a silenced pistol, and you only get like seven bullets or some shit. Yeah, I exactly. Yeah. I didn't you get really low ammo. You gotta use hands and shit like that to distract the enemies. It was kind of like Metal Gear, Metal Gear Solid, but it was more stealth based. It was more in depth. Yeah, no, it was nuts. That game put me through a roller coaster. Splinter Cell, they some like. Of the, some of the puzzles were just like, holy fuck. They ain't fucking around. I've Tom never played Slancy. a Splinter Cell game though. You have it? No. No. I've seen my dad play the first one or so. But... What you've seen is what to expect, pretty much. They haven't made there was one Splinter Cell that was really good. It was called like Double Recon or something. You could play co-op with a friend. That sounds like fun. I think it was Double Agent or something like that. Yeah, I'm here. I played it with my brother. We we got pretty far. We never beat it. Because we, we, I remember getting into like this one mission where you're on a fucking ship and it, I don't know, we, either, I, I don't think we could figure out what to do. <laughs> you know what else was a really fun stealth game was Tenchu. That was a fucking good game. So <laughs> Those games are cool though. They should bring that back. I beat Tenchu though. 
wasn't that bad. I could never was... understand. Like, I, I'm so bad at stealth games to begin with. Tenshu, man, you're literally a ninja in feudal Japan, and you have to assassinate guards and shit. It's so cool. That sounds cool. It's on the PS2, right? And there's a, on the Xbox version, Return from Darkness, um, there's a third character, because you know how you, you have Ricky Maru, which fights with a katana, and you have a Yame, fights with, with daggers, or tanto, tantos, or whatever? Sure. There's a third guy that's a doctor, and he fights with a needle. That's ah. awesome. He li his crazy. stealth attack, he literally jumps on you and shoves a needle in the back of your head and it kills <laughs> you. I got more fucked up. <laughs> he's such a- he's a cool ass character. He's like a doctor in the day and an assassin at night or something. Shout out to your boy Dexter. Well, I mean Dexter wasn't a doctor, but... Shoving needles and people at night, Captain. <laughs> Shove a needle in your asshole. <laughs> ah, dude. Mom, get the camera. <laughs> One time. Mom, get the dildo. <laughs> Mom, camera. William, I need some help here. Hurry. Josh, get in the shower. Yet, yet, yet. Damn, dude. Josh, get in the shower. I said 15 classic. minutes ago. Fucking classic. That shit was so funny. Josh, no. Dad, after this game, no, Josh. No. Nah, that, that's the thing that sucks about living with your parents. Is you always have to listen to what they say. And it's like, what do you want? When you're an adult. I'm so glad that I don't live with my fucking parents. Yeah, I agree with you. Yeah. My parents still bother me though. Well, besides my mom. Well, mine don't even more know. since I live alone. Yeah. What were you saying? Shoot all. I, my parents never really bothered me. But like my mom would just like come into my room for no reason. She'd be like, what you doing? I'm What's like, I'm on, I'm on the computer. <laughs> she walk in, you got your cock in your hand. Damn, dude. You're like one stroke away from a massive cum shot and she walks in. <laughs> God damn, dude. I had my mom walk in one time and I would literally been beaten off and I literally fucking put my dick in my pants as fast as I fucking could. <laughs> I've been there, done that. I already got my dick in my pants in a split second. You're like... <laughs> Speed of light. You're fucking beat red. Are you okay? Yeah, I was watching cops. <laughs> I, I need to go to bed now. Can you leave? Uh, I've never been caught jacking off though. I've no. probably jerked off 10,000 times in my life. Okay, maybe not that much, but definitely in the thousands. I don't and know. Oh. My parents never caught me jacking off. Not a single time. I don't think it... No. I got I've, I've, a couple of times, too. Come on, I've gotten it go. where I was like... This was when I was living at my, uh, my with my parents. I, like, my brothers, like... They would come into my room and be like... But I wasn't like beating my dick, I was Hold just like on. looking at uh... <laughs> I was like looking at uh, like pictures of like girls in like uh, lingerie. That was before, I, uh, that was a more innocent time for me. Before I found out. You naked? This is, no, this is before the hub though. This is when I was like... I think before I was, the hub, like, man, I used to go to this one website, it was just nothing but nude photos of girls. Right, this is like before that. I started whacking off when I was like eight years old. Oh no. Oh my god. I was a fucking, Damn, dude. I was a fucking silverback, dude. This, this is back silver in the black gorilla. I'll put this in like perspective. I'm talking about when they used to have those like, uh, those Girls Gone Wild videos at like in the middle of the night. You remember? Where it would all be censored. 
I remember my brother used to rent movies just because girls would pull their tops off. <laughs> yeah. I remember that shit. We're talking about early Good old days, yeah. That's before I got into porn. I started getting into porn when I was like 12. 13, I think, for me. I think it was 12. Man, the first time I watched porn, I was five. No joke. When I saw it, it was 13. I was like, whoa. I was young when I saw it. I was around like five or six. I didn't know what the fuck yeah, was going on. Yeah, I was like on. five the first time I saw my first porn and I didn't know what to do. I know my <laughs> dick was getting hard. I just didn't know why. Yeah, I was I was in the same boat. I was like, my fucking good. dick was hard. I was like... It felt good, so I just kept watching it. Same. <laughs> That's exactly what I did. And it, it was really a porno with these... It was, it was lesbian porn too, and it was like... It was softcore porn where all you saw was their tits, but you kind of saw them like eating each other out and shit, but you didn't get to see their pussy. Right. It was like that kind of porn. Oh, yeah. It wasn't like in depth. It wasn't... Oh, you weren't seeing the good good. Nope. It's crazy. I was whacking my baloney. How the fuck did he stumble up on that? Was it just on uh, like television? My dad had rented the Playboy channel and I just wow. actually I clicked on it one day and I just typed in a random code and it took it. <laughs> my dad's password was like 999 or some shit. It looked really easy. I sat there and I watched porn for like 20 minutes and I went back to bed. Oh. My parents still don't know about that shit. <laughs> My mom actually used to buy my dad porn because ah. he worked third shift. He worked third shift, so my mom would be asleep by the time he would get home. My dad would want to like wank it or something. <laughs> I guess my mom wouldn't have sex with him at 4 a.m. Oh, well, doesn't sound like it. Yeah, she bought him porn. I remember her telling me. My dad used to have this desk with a lock in it. Like in one of the... One of the drawers had a lock. And one day we got in it, he had like... He had like... several copies of Playboys. Oh, yeah, dog. No wonder he got uh, the deep board. Oh, you got a divorce for drinking. Damn. My mom encouraged his wanking, okay? Good, yeah. Ain't nothing wrong. Yeah. It didn't bother, I don't think it bothered my mom at all that he whacked off the porn. But it was kind of like a thing where he worked a different schedule than my mom, so they couldn't have sex during the week. Yeah, I don't know. Sometimes you just gotta whack your baloney, you know? Exactly. Smack the sausage, see? But yeah, like... I got into porn... I think when I got the internet, actually, which is like in 2001 or some shit, is when I got internet. That's a lot of damage. William, I'm closing in on the Odin main control center. Let's meet there once you've disabled the starboard defense system. But my brother would like... My brother had like VHS's of porn. It was like shitty porn at low quality. <laughs>
now it's just normal. Like you can literally go anywhere and get porn with the with the internet. Porn in like five seconds. Busty Beauty 69. He didn't. He didn't. It was a lot more difficult hey, back then, hey, that's for sure. Yeah. Hmm? What was? To watch porn? Find, like, just to find stuff like that. <laughs> I remember the first porn I ever watched. I think I still can find it through the set. First porn Busty Horse 69. Yeah, Mine was like a lesbian point. Dude. Ah, yes, yes. Yes. Now, now we're talking. <laughs> no. The first, the first actual porn that I watched was like some porn from the 80s. It was like two chicks trying to fuck this guy. I'm outside the Odin Main Control Center. Lots of activity in this place. Get here as fast as you can. Hey. What the fuck? Man? Track a turn back time. To the good old days. Rock. When the blacks were lynched, but now Whoa. they're free and jumping out. You guys want to cringe a little bit? <laughs> Was it a cringe compilation? Oh god, we're calling for one time. No. I hate watching cringe, I gotta be honest. I love it. So do I. I can't, I can't help it, to be honest. The I one hate it I sometimes it actually it. makes me cringe. This should be a part, She's like, of a... Uh, just check this out, this guy is so hairy. <laughs> oh, I can no. turn back British time. British. To the good old days. Yeah, this guy's a straight weeb, boo. <laughs> How's your girlfriend? I don't have a GF. Haha, <laughs> I know, just reminding you. How's your dad? <laughs> <laughs> Super effective. <sighs> He's got a katana? Damn, dude, a katana. Yo, this is a video of me, Kappa. <laughs> what is that fucking hairline? <laughs> Give it up, bro. Oh, God. Oh, God. You're right, you can't sheath it. I know, he can't even sheath it. <laughs> Woo! The mountain, you know. Oh, that video is so all over the place. <sighs> Wish I could turn back time to the good old days. When the blacks were slaves, but now they're free and jumping out. Then suddenly... Oh, God. Wish I could turn back time to the good old days. When the fags were lynched. Wow, yeah. I already contacted. Rated E. Rated oh. H. Homosexuals. Oh no. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Deeper? Yeah. Time to go down the trashy. Trashy. World. Mother tried to push her son in front of a vehicle. Whoa! Damn, dude. Whoops, a little accident over there. Those sounds like. Dude, that's fucked up. Yeah. 
I'm trying to get uh, my way up top. I'm trying to get insurance. Life insurance by killing her kid? Damn. Yeah. I guess I don't know. Savage. Ex wife left the house like he was caught cheating. What? Lots the family. I'm still going to court. She didn't pay the work. Okay. Damn, dude. Uh, I don't give a fuck. Yen yen. Hooked on the look. How I rebuilt my body and became insta famous. Gives a fuck. <laughs> it takes a long time to rebuild your body. For real. What in the fuck is this? Michael Jackson revenge. Must be the old main control center. Why? What are you doing with your life? I don't know, dude. Crack. What the fuck? That sounds awesome, Kappa. <laughs> Do you wanna hit? <laughs> what the fuck? You wanna hit? <laughs> Want a hit of that amphetamine? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, I found a uh, Confederate Santa's bedroom. Confederate Santa Claus special. The files are too strong. Yeah. Oh, you Good to hear you getting close, William. I can't show it because it's being dumb. Yeah, dude. Okay. Wish I could turn back time to the good old days. Whatever platform is taking down me, man. Yeah, Lower yeah, platform. Yeah. What the fuck? There's a picture of a girl. I'm assuming this is. I'm assuming this is like, uh. What do they call it? Ah, oh, fuck. Tender. I'm assuming this is Tender, and it's like. Or maybe it's Instagram. She's, she's taking a picture, like a selfie. And she's. In the bio, it says. I didn't understand until now. But lower class men are annoying as fuck. What? <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, I mean she's damaged inside, so it means... <sighs> Probably an irre irrelevant whore. <sighs> Probably nothing through a cock. Oh my god. C nothing C like... Cock. Nothing like... <laughs> In my ass. Nothing like it. Plus, hot girls are hot pergamus. It's proven. Damn, dude. I got black, dude. The big black got me. Fucking Wolfenstein too. This episode has a lot of good commentary content. You guys are being recorded the whole time. Nice, dude. Yeah, yeah. Do I, do I get a cut? <laughs> yeah. I do. We get three pieces of catfish and shrimp. 
Oh, 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 Two ham, dude. Holy fuck. Two fucking ham, dude. Someone's doing lines off grandma's tomb. <laughs> Whoa, dude. <laughs> God damn, dude. Check to him back time. To the good old day. What the fuck? She's out here like wrapping her crack pipe? What the fuck? What the fuck? What, what is this photo? God damn, man. The kind of content I can find on Trashy. <laughs> trashy. Yeah, I know. I mean, I upload at a decent rate. It's not like... I mean, my are slower than this. Trashy. Go all the Nazis. Go all the Nazis. Fucking Berman Commander. Who? Whoa. No, I got this. Dude, nine gag has some of the most fucked up. Yeah, that's why I, I stick with that. <laughs> dude, have you seen? Look up base Mario. A nine gag. Base Mario. Dude. What the fuck is this? This girl's body's all saggy. Ah. She's like naked. Oh. I'm not loose, you're just small. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, I, just, I was about to say that. I just got fucking destroyed. You took the words out of my mouth, dude. Die, mother... <laughs> Dollar store hooker. Dollar store hooker, yeah. Uh -huh. Worth it. Order for someone to deep dick me rapidly and repeatedly until my water breaks on your hog. Why? It breaks you can keep going. I hear amniotic fluid looks like pickled juice, smells like hot ham. Oh my god. After that, you can guide me through labor until the fruit of my womb bursts its way out of me face first. Six weeks and a couple stitches later, I'll be ready to raw dog it again. Hit me up. Damn. If you're man enough, comma daddy. Holy shit. Damn, dude. Qualify. 
That has to be a fake fucking profile. God damn. The most legit one yet, do you even? Damn. <laughs> Local Walmart, really? Local Walmart. This girl has like ass cheeks hanging out. What the fuck? Restart, oh my god. I'm gonna kill myself. There's no fucking way this is happening, dude. Nope. I'm fucking tapping out, dude. 